Yeah, I'm just trying to put these videos in, you guys. That's all. Get my numbers up. Get my numbers up. Universe, give us some information. I'm just doing some general reading. I'm not calling no signs. Only during the reading will I call the signs. Counselor came back. No, I got let wait. Let me shuffle these cards because I just had these cards. I just looked at it. Let me shuffle. Uh, if the same information come out, I'm gonna use a different deck. That's all. Make sure you hit a like and subscribe and make sure you check out my store and make some purchase on some items that I have. I have candles. As you can see, this is uh, one of my candles from my store, Tamar Candles. This is coconut and mango that I'm burning right now. Coconut mango. Which smells really great. It sets my energy, my mood in a positive way. Okay, we have unfound fear. Expecting the worst. This creating self-fulfilling prophecies. Allowing worries to grow out of proportion to the situation. Sleepless nights. Refocus your thoughts. So the universe wants you to refocus your thoughts. This is the nine of swords. Refocus your thoughts. Here we have the cups. Knight of cups. A love of art and, and um, poetry. So someone rushing in with romance, flirtation. It could be somebody coming to you um, and the universe wants you to refocus your thoughts. Refocus your thoughts. Falling in love or the resurgency of a romantic relationship forgiveness and the ending of challenges ex changing gifts don't give up on people you love so the universe don't want you to give up on this person don't give up on someone you love you have the five of wands conflicts with others caused by Opposite opinions, walk away from drama unless the situation is really worth your time. Then stand up for yourself. Very ambitious people. So somebody tried to bring some damn drama to you and you had to walk away from it. They tried to start some shit and you just brushed it off, walked off, left it alone. Stand up for yourself and your beliefs. Have confidence, challenge those in power, but also choose your battle wisely. That's right. Like I said, fire sign, let it go. Universe is telling you to let it go. You had some drama with a water sign. A water sign is rushing into you with forgiveness, sorry, this, that, and the third. They want to apologize for what they did. But nope, you want to argue, you want to fight. And the universe is telling you, don't argue with this person, don't fight. Walk away from it. 
It's not worth it. Stand up for yourself and what you believe, yeah. But make better choices. Don't be out there fighting what you're fighting for. Why? You cheated on the fire sign and now the water sign cheated on you? What is it? Fire cheated on water and now water cheated on you and now water asking you to forgive them and let's patch things up. But you did all the dirt in the fucking world, fire sign. The water sign cheated. And the water sign is asking you to forgive them. Let's start a new beginning. Let's repatch our love, our romance. The love is still there. The universe is telling you to choose your battles wisely. The emperor on board, my favorite card, logic and organization will increase your success. Take charge of the situation. Accept leadership role, structure and discipline. In order to be a leader, you have to discipline yourself. That's like cutting out certain foods. That's like eating a certain way, eating a certain diet. You understand? You discipline yourself. Why? Because with that discipline, that with you discipline, dis, I'm tired, disciplining yourself, you are creating better structure within your inside body. You know, like you healing your body inside and the outside of your body. From disciplining yourself on the foods that you eat. You know, you're giving your body a chance to heal and recover. So, structure and discipline is very important in life. You have to know how to structure and organize your life. If you don't, you write it. If you don't know how to write it, you plan it in your head. Fire, night. Okay, night of wands and a reversal. Passion, confident, cosmetic. Restless events require immediate action. Trust your instincts. Mm -hmm. Stay focused. A passionate relationship. It's in a reversal. So it's letting me know ain't no passion, relationship, nothing. Fire sign. The looks on this card, you run in the opposite way. You run it towards a new passionate relationship. Fire sign again. You're running. It's in a reversal. You're not going towards them. You don't give a fuck what they talking about. You're not forgiving them. Again, fire energy. Victory, wise choice that brings public recognition and success, promotion, awards, or scholarship. The universe is applauding you for leaving a situation. You made a wise choice. Public recognition. Everybody know in your circle what's going on. So by you moving forward, you releasing someone. You're not holding them against their will. You starting a new beginning. Victory is yours. You letting go. You're not trying to hold. You're not trying to structure. You're not trying to make it seem like you happy in a situation. You're letting it go. Page, here go water again. I'm telling y'all, this is water. It's one air on board, which is the air. It could be the air energy of, you know, depression, can't sleep, constantly thinking on your mind. Because, you know, that's 
air energy, always thinking, always planning, always trying to see a way out of a situation. You're sensitive, open-hearted, inexperienced, moody message regarding a relationship. New emotional experience, a romantic encounter, social invitation or event heightens your psychic abilities. So this is my car where somebody is delivering some message that's going to get you, that's going to change your emotions. It's going to, this is going to, when you hear this message, it's going to change how you feel about this person. So this fire sign heard some shit about this water sign and he's not feeling it at all. This person, this water sign is trying to rush in romantically, flirtatiously, you know, introspective, falling in love again, being swept off your feet, a sudden love affair, a lack of balance in a relationship, situation, or topic that makes your heart flutter. A love of art and poetry. So, this water sign stepped out of a situation and now rushing in to heal a situation. Realizing that they fallen in love. They resurfaced old energy. Romantic relationship, forgiveness, and the ending of challenges. Exchanging gifts. So you guys are trying to heal a situation. You guys want to fall in love again. You guys want to exchange gifts again. You guys want to give up on other people and focus on y'all love. But somebody don't want that because you got this reversal fire sign. Fire night. That passion and all that is out the door, baby. Passionate relationship out the door, baby. That's in a person. That fire sign like over here with the eight, the six of one victory. I made a wise choice. <laughs> I'm about to make this shit public. I'm telling everybody. <laughs> I'm divorced. I'm separate. Whatever. I'm single. Ready to mingle. This water sign is upset. They receive a message that they don't agree with. This person needs to told them straight up to their face how they feel. Let me get my ghetto cards, y'all. Because, you know, with the ghetto cards, we're going to hear. Damn, y'all. I've been eating for hours. It's been working. I can't say I don't be working for y'all. For free. Okay. Oh, shit. All right. Uh, somebody getting an apartment. Somebody about to go shopping for this apartment. Somebody driving a truck. Somebody is non-commitment. They not trying to commit to no one right now. Somebody in their whole energy. Um, somebody getting commitment. Bad credit. Unpaid bills. And somebody need a, a hot wax. That's all I have for you guys. I'm going to leave it at that. Have a good night.